This tutorial will show you how to use the free SMC Karaoke Manager on your Windows PC to create CD plus Gs from SMC files downloaded from the store. If you have not yet downloaded and installed the SMC Karaoke Manager, follow the tutorial entitled the SMC Karaoke Manager Downloading and Installing Software. If you are using a Macintosh computer, we recommend using KJams. Please see the store's help page for more information. Switch to your desktop and double click the SMC Karaoke Manager to launch the software. When the SMC Karaoke Manager launches, it will scan your disk drive for SMC files and will import the SMC files it finds into the database. If you need to change the directory that the SMC Karaoke Manager scans, click File, Add SMC Files. The starting folder will be displayed. If you need to change it, click Change and navigate to a new directory or folder. Click OK. Only new files found by a scan will be added to the database. The SMC Karaoke Manager is comprised of three sections. The library, where all your songs are listed. The playlist, where you create playlists of songs. The player, to play songs. The top section of the SMC Karaoke Manager is the library. This section lists all of your karaoke songs that you've imported. The reason that we're seeing two of each of some of these titles is because we downloaded the version without lead vocal as well as the version with lead vocal. In some cases, you may even see more than two of the same song title. This will happen if you purchase both the audio without scrolling lyrics and the video with lyrics and downloaded all available tracks without lead vocal and with lead vocal. If you have a large library, you can use the search by song title or artist or file name. To clear search results, click the X button. To play a song, you need to add it to a playlist. Select a song and click Add to Playlist. When you add an audio file to the playlist, a dialog will appear to advise you that the song does not contain lyrics. Audio will play, but lyrics will not be displayed. Click OK to continue. Continue to add songs to your playlist. Since CDRs can only contain so many minutes, it is a good idea to keep an eye on the playing time of your playlist. Check the instructions or label that came with your blank CDRs for the amount of time available. Remember that DVDRs are not supported. To change the order of songs in your playlist, use the arrows up and down. Click X to remove a song from the playlist. If you need to clear the playlist completely, click Clear Playlist. The player controls are found beside the player. Play, pause, stop, previous song, next song. If you purchased video songs, the lyrics will be displayed when you click play. If you purchase audio songs, the music will play, but the lyrics will not be displayed. To burn your songs to a CD, create a playlist no longer than what your CDR can contain. Click Burn CD. The Burn CD plus G dialog will appear. If you have more than one CD burner connected to your system, select the burner device that you wish to use. Refer to your CD burner user guide to determine the best speed at which to burn a CD. Insert a blank CDR into your disk drive. Do not use DVD-Rs. Click Burn. Note that not all CD drives support burning CD plus G disks. Check your CD burner's user guide. If you experience difficulty playing a burn CD plus G in your karaoke machine, click Tools, then Settings. The Settings dialog will appear. Click Use CDR DAO Burning Engine. Click OK and burn another CD plus G. If you need help using SMC Karaoke Manager, click Help SMC Manager or press F1. Search for help by topic. Or, if you're having trouble burning a CD plus G, review the CD plus G burning troubleshooting tips. If you need to purchase more songs, click Shop for Songs.